Good morning, Copper Basin. Today is Tuesday, December 9th, 2014. I'm Reed O'Neill. And I'm Tristan Stowell, and this is CBTV News in 9. On today's show, we'll be talking about the box tops and a sports fact. Now let's get started. For everyone out there that did not hear before, we are still collecting box tops from food items with the Box Tops for Education stamp. Please bring in any you might have. The more we collect, the more books we can get for our school. So, bring your box tops, we get books. Fair trade. Let's go to weather. Today is going to be mostly cloudy with a 30% chance of rain showers. Highs are in the upper 30s to mid 40s with the temperature steady or slowly falling in the afternoon. Northwest winds are at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tonight will be mostly cloudy with a slight chance of rain showers and snow showers in the evening and a slight chance of snow showers after midnight. Lows are going to be in the 20s to lower 30s. North winds will be at 5 to 10 miles per hour with a chance of precipitation at 20%. Wednesday is becoming mostly sunny with highs in the 30s to mid-40s. Northwest winds will be at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Now back to the anchors. Well, thanks for the weather. Snow? Still, I'm, I'm waiting for snow. I'm waiting I'm really, for it, too. really, really like some snow. Yeah. Just like this last week we're here, that would be awesome. Yeah, because then we would be out like all week. Yeah. Well, snow start the PSA. I know I could get arrested and lose my license if I drive impaired. And I know I could get grounded forever. I know I need to be home by curfew, but I still need to drive safely and obey stop signs and red lights. I know I may get grounded, but it's better than not getting home at all. Wow, so I do know a lot. I know that teens are more likely to be in crashes than adults. Did you know more than 300,000 teens are injured in crashes each year? It doesn't matter if you're an old driver or a new driver, please be careful on the roads, you can still get into crashes. And did you know that Silent Night was first sung as part of a church service in Austria? A guitar was used because the church organ was so badly rusted it couldn't be played. Now let's go over to Riley for sports. We have a basketball game at Nanahala Thursday, so come out and support your Cougars. And that's all for your sports. Goodbye to the anchors. Thanks hey, for the sports, sports Riley. Yeah. You basketball, the basketball game? game? I will not. Nanahala is too far of a drive for me. Very true. Let's go over to lunch. Okay, today for lunch, in line one is hamburgers and fries, fruit, juice, and milk. And in line two is braided chicken sandwich, potato rounds, beans, fruit, juice, and milk. And for breakfast tomorrow, in line one is sliced bagel, fruit, juice, and milk. And in line two is mini cinnamon rolls, fruit, juice, and milk. Now that's all for lunch. Sad slide. You see that? Mm -hmm. No music bump. Yep. Let's, <sighs> Let's go to a sponsor ad. When he first joined the army, I was very nervous. Uh, we didn't know what they would have him doing. But Bobby always had a plan. Unmatched training in over 150 careers beyond the battlefield, there are over 150 surprising ways to burst on her daughter about opportunities in the Army. Birthdays today are Brianna O'Neill and Coach Johnson. Happy birthday to you. Once again, there will be a basketball game on the 11th at Nanahala. The toy box drive is still in the lobby. Did you hear about that guy at Six Flags that got hurt on the roller coaster? Yeah, he did. Like, apparently some cable snapped and it cut the whole left side of his body off. It's okay, though. He's all right now. That's all the time we have for today's show. We'll see you tomorrow on CBTV News at 9.